never slow up No, I don't take shit. I got no love for the fakeness If you wanna play tough and wanna hate this I'll always show up and make a statement People have asked me about prisoners working out without weights In some places they got machine weights But they've taken the free weights out of most Missouri prisons I think all of them actually And they wonder why they still get so muscular the thing is, the ones that are muscular are the ones who work out. There are many, not all prisoners are muscular. Not every convict is in it. Some of them don't do much. Some of them are in the law library. And uh, the library and other places. So they don't, they don't work out much. The others, that's all they think about is working out or playing basketball or something. You have, when you're in prison and there's no access to weights of any kind, you have to get creative. A lot of times it was just body weight, you know, push-ups, pull-ups, uh, burpees, and you change. As you progress, you change. You, you vary your exercises. You don't want, you know, not only just doing the same thing all the time, get boring, but you want to change up to, to shock the muscles. So you might be doing regular push-ups. Might do them wide one time, narrow the next time, Christmas tree type, hands up like this the next time. You know, there's different ways of doing push-ups. I've seen some people doing push-ups with their legs off the floor, their feet off the floor. Just their arms are on, their hands are on the floor. There's many different ways. You just got to vary. The thing with, when you, when you don't have weights, the thing is, is a lot of reps and do each rep until failure I mean each set until failure a lot of people think well I'm going to do 10 push-ups that's one set I'm going to do another 10 push-ups that's another set no if you can only get five only get five if you can get 10 get 10 if you get more than that but the thing is to go until you can't do another one the same way with pull-ups pull yourself up until you can't pull yourself up again that's how you build. But you do a lot of reps. You know. It doesn't mean you have to do it all day long. You know. That's another myth. Many prisoners don't work out all day long. There's some that that do. There's a few that do that work out whenever they get the chance. And then they'll work out in their cell. You don't have to do that. Just but you do it's best to get as many reps in, in as you can, you know. And another thing I would advise people working out like this, because you can do this at home, is if you're just starting out, just do what you can. Don't overdo it. You know, a lot of reps might, to you might be 10. You know? But you're gradually going to get to where that 10 is easy, and you're going to have to move up to more reps. You also need to know the, the science of the body, too. Really. And, and prisoners know. Wider uh, push-ups will work your chest more. Elevated will work your, uh, you know, with your feet uh, elevated will work the upper chest more and they're harder to do. Feet on the floor will work more of the lower uh, chest. But you can start with off of the counter of your kitchen or something with your feet back if you can't do them on, on the floor yet. Then you go down when you can do them real easy, you go down with your knees on the floor and then you get to where you put your, you don't have to have your knees on the floor. Many times when I'm doing push-ups, I'll start out with a set, well, after I do a warm-up, I'll start out with a set with my feet elevated. As soon as I can get as many as I can get on that, I'll drop down and do them with my feet on the floor. Get as many as I can with that and then drop down with my knees on the floor and just keep going trying to get as many reps in as I can and that, that's the key I did a little video here a while back where I was doing a few uh, reps of uh, exercises up at the park and I think I'm going to show that at the end of this it's not a full workout because it wasn't a half of a workout it was just I was demonstrating different types of exercises and so I might I think I'm going to show that at the end and uh, I hope that because people are asking me about this all the time, and it's getting summertime. People might want to be trying to get in shape or something. I don't know. But
but anybody can do this. Anybody. It doesn't take a lot. It, you don't need a gym. The one thing I found out though is, like if you've been, <laughs> you've been working out. I mean, if you've been working manual labor all day, you come home. Most people just want to sit and relax. They, they, they ain't wanting to do push-ups or anything like that, you know. <laughs> Don't even want to go anywhere. You want to take a shower and just sit back and relax, you know. So, and that's the thing with prisoners. Many of them are not only dedicated, but they, they have the time. You know, it's not like they're doing eight hours of manual labor and then uh, working out, you know. They all have jobs, but it's not eight hours and it's not really manual labor. It's not that hard, you know. So it's different with them. They got the time, they got the dedication and all that. And uh, I remember before I got out, I thought, yeah, I'm going to keep up with working out. When I got out, and I did until I got a job. And I got this job with construction and my workout fell off completely. I'm starting to get back into it a little bit, but I can't work out nothing like I used to. I'm trying to build back up, but we'll see what happens. And I thank you guys for watching, and uh, I hope you enjoyed this, and thank you. Oh, hit that like and subscribe.